If elected, what would you do to help continue to promote job growth and grow Florida's economy? Well, I think it's important to have an economy that provides stable jobs and economic development that's critical to the growth and sustainability of not only the state, but also the district that I'm running for, District 14. I would work with small businesses to eliminate any non-essential regulations that are discouraging growth and discouraging individuals from starting businesses, um, as well as to help them obtain any certifications that they need um, and to make it a more efficient process. When it comes to um, advocating for any legislation that would be beneficial to the business community, certainly we are seeing that um, expanding protection to LGBT people is a, a growth factor for a lot of industries and whether or not they're going to come into a state and I would be supportive of those efforts. How would you improve Florida's health care situation? Well, I would certainly advocate for Medicaid expansion to assist those who are caught in the gap where they're not receiving health care and they can't afford to pay for health care. Um, having a healthy workforce is critical to making sure that your employees show up and get the job done and are healthy enough to benefit a company. Um, also, there are areas in the state that are underserved and certainly efforts for telemedicine that brings medical care, health care in the underserved areas would be beneficial. What challenges do you see in Florida's K-12 through education system? And if elected, what would you do to address those challenges? One of the greatest challenges that I see has to do with funding and um, the use of high stakes testing. I would advocate for adequate funding to bring us up to the level that we should be at based on inflation and population growth, as well as to eliminate high stakes testing to make sure that we are properly measuring students teachers and schools. Making sure that we have an educated and capable workforce is important to the state of Florida to attract businesses. And so if we can improve public education, we can improve the workforce, we can prepare people to be um, better employees, and certainly that would help the economy. My name is Leslie Jean Barr. I'm running for House District 14 in Jacksonville, it covers the northwest side of Jacksonville. And my website is voteforlesley.com and it's V-O-T-E-F-O-R-L-E-S-L-I-E.